All right. Oh man, doesn't this look good? Three foot grinder challenge today. So this is an Italian grinder. Um, let's see what it has for meat. I think it's got ham. Um, I heard it had pepperoni and there's some salami. Yeah, so ham, pepperoni, and salami. Lots of vegetables. Let's see, I see lettuce. I see onions. I see some peppers. So there's probably some other stuff in here I don't see either. But yeah, this is a three foot sub. Uh, I was told it was about nine pounds. So it's about nine pound, three pound. Yeah, nine pound, three foot sub. <clears throat> who told me that? Actually, the person who made this for me was the same person that made the lasagna challenge for me. G7 Catering. They, I asked if they could get a three foot piece of bread. Because I looked, I went around all kinds of supermarkets and see if I get a big piece of bread like this. I couldn't find it. They were able to do it. They threw together the sandwich for me. I appreciate it so much. Well, this thing, it looks good. The only problem I think I'm going to have is I think they stored it in the fridge. So it's freezing cold. So I made myself some hot coffee right here just so I can sip on that. And hopefully I don't get too cold during this challenge because it is kind of cold in here. Why isn't it going to get to May already? We should be warm outside, but it's not warm outside yet. So, all right. So I'm looking forward to this. After doing a bunch of sweet challenges, this is going to be really good. I love sandwich challenges. But sandwich challenges are hard. Let me just start cutting this manageable pieces here. Maybe I'll try to do it in four, four pieces. Sandwich challenges are hard. They're probably like one of the hardest things like... You, you're never going to see someone do like a 20 pound sandwich. It's just not by themselves. It's not possible. Oh, I also got some of the drink over here. Let me open one up. Yeah, let me put that over here. But that lettuce tastes fresh. All right, so let's get into this. Let me start the timer. I also got some chips over here. Some Doritos from, I looks like Japanese writing on there from me. And so I'm going to try to snack on those as well. All right. This will be, oh, yeah. Lots of bread. Oh, you can see. Let's see if I can see the cross section there. Pretty good amount of meats. We got, oh, cheese on there as well. Yep. You can see lots of bread, though. This is going to be a, maybe I should have cut a smaller slice. Oh, I put some, um, I put Thousand Island dressing. I put some ranch dressing. And I put some mayonnaise on there as well. So. We got everything. Hopefully I put enough. I can always put some more. Mm. That tastes so good. It tastes like so fresh. The vegetables are fresh. The meat tastes good. The bread tastes fresh. Such a difference between doing a challenge like this and like a sweets challenge or like a one I just get some stuff from fast food place. I do think I'm gonna get cold though. Good thing I got this coffee. It should help me out a little bit. Oh, that is so good.
bread is really good. <clears throat> I wish I could find a place that sold like big pieces of bread like this. I think everything in the sandwich is in the correct proportion. There's the perfect amount of vegetables, perfect amount of meat, cheese. Like not one, not one thing here overpowers another thing. Well, it's a perfect job. I hate like when they put too many vegetables and that's how you taste the vegetables or, or they put like too much of the cheaper meats in there. But this is like perfect. All right, first piece down. This is gonna take a while. I didn't break any speed records on that. Um, eight minutes, huh? Jeez, let me cut another slice off. I'll cut it off this side here. I'll eat the ends first. I prefer the ends anyways. I think this is bigger than the first one. Holy cow. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Oh, I definitely gonna run out of coffee though. It's gonna, it's gonna suck when that happens. But Definitely a lot of chewing. Good jaw workout. <sighs> There's still a lot left for the job. <laughs> All right. I was thinking about trying to eat just one piece, but I don't know. I think it might fall apart. Let me um let me cut it. 
do it in two halves here. This is still a big piece, holy cow. That's it for the coffee and I'm starting to get cold, so we better hurry up here. Definitely getting cold. One more big slice left. Oh. Let's see, you gotta dump out some of these burritos too. Right. I got mayonnaise all over my fingers. have a funny flavor oh there's a picture of a taco on the bag there must be taco flavor yeah that's what it tastes like tacos taco flavored doritos huh a lot of sandwich left to go let's just get this done Thank you. 
I'm actually starting to shiver. We'll get it done though. All right, almost done. Oh. Tell you what, taco flavor Doritos, not my favorite. I would never buy those. All right. All right. Three foot sandwich made by G7 Catering. It was absolutely delicious. That might have been the, the my best, uh, my favorite Italian sub I've ever eaten. I think so, yeah. Yeah, it was perfect. Big. Oh, I feel full though. Sandwich challenges are hard. Actually, I'm very surprised I didn't drink more. Eating all that bread, but we got it done. I am freezing though. I gotta get in front of like an electric heater or go take a warm shower or something. I'm starting to shiver. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, share. Uh yeah, all that stuff. Oh my god, I got a lot of burps. Japanese Doritos are not good. I think they're Japanese. Maybe Chinese. I don't know. Anyways, oh, I'm just yammering. I gotta go.